Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to create a debossed effect in Procreate. So just make sure you have your letter or shape or whatever you want to give that debossed effect to ready to go. So first we're going to pick our background color. If you hold your finger down on the screen, you can pick your background color to the so it's the same color, any color you want. This is how you color pick or one way that you can color pick. And then we're going to change our letter or shape to that same color as the background so you can't see it. And then we're going to duplicate that layer twice and then create make them both clipping masks. And then we'll change the bottom one layer mode to multiply. And then we'll change the top one to screen. We'll turn our screen layer off and we'll go to our multiply layer with our direct um, selection tool up here. We're going to move it up to the top left slightly, just a little bit. And then we'll go to our blur and we'll blur it a little bit around about 6%. And then we'll go back into our layers panel and we'll choose our screen layer, turn that one on, get our selection tool again and we'll move it down to the bottom right. We'll move it down about the same as what we did with the multiply layer and then we'll go to our blur and we'll blur it again the same amount, about 6%. Then we'll go back to our layers panel and we'll just turn the opacity for that screen layer down a little bit. I think I just made it about halfway, it's like 47% or something like that. And that looks pretty cool already as it is like that. Um, and to make it a little bit more like it's in paper, you can download these paper effect layers from Google. If you Google um, paper effects, there's so many different paper effects that you can download for free. All like different types of paper or canvases or you know different sort of textures that you want it depends what you're what you're kind of after i have these two as an example ones um i don't know if it's like a recycled kind of paper um maybe kind of like a recycled paper the other one the other one's way more like a recycled sort of paper i don't know what this paper's called that's called something this is more of a recycled kind of paper which has like a cool texture so I'll show you the first one first. So just make sure the layer covers the whole canvas and we'll just change the layer mode to multiply and like that's it. You can go through and try out different layer modes because different um, types of paper textures are going to look differently on different layer modes because they all have different, you know, dark spots and light spots and or, you know, different hues or whatever. They all look different. I think multiply generally, multiply or overlay, I think are generally the best ones for most of the ones I've found. And you can change with the, um, the opacity to get it, you know, how you're kind of wanting it. I sort of want to keep that purple color with a little bit of texture. And um, that looks pretty cool.